Hey what's good, I'm Sadia and I've had the Nintendo Switch online membership for just over two years now and personally I think that it's been worth it. However, if you're contemplating whether you should purchase it or not, then hopefully this video will help you because I'll walk you through ex every single feature that you get so you can decide for yourself if it's worth your money. Let's check it out. Okay, so let's open up the Nintendo Switch online app. And as you can see in the top left corner, I've been a a member for what two years two months and 24 days now and I don't have the individual membership I've got the family membership which means that anyone that I add can also benefit from having their online membership essentially so you can have up to eight people in a family membership and I guess it's just more cost effective than everyone buying their own so if you go onto the home section you can see some of the benefits so for example you can try out some games which is always good so you get a feel for the game before you invest your money into buying it and just some other extras like you can see here the uh, if you have the expansion pack membership you do get to play some Game Boy Advance games like you can see here so you've got The Legend of Zelda, Mario Kart, Super Mario Advance 4, Mario and Luigi etc but you have to have the expansion pack which I don't have uh, that's an additional cost so that's on top of the Nintendo Switch Online membership. I don't have that, so I can't really comment on whether it's worth it or not, but you can see that you get six additional games if you were to get that expansion pack. So um, it's not just those six games, actually. You do actually get some other benefits. So for example, with Mario Kart, if you've got that game, you get the booster pack, and with other games, you get some extra things like icons or accessories for specific games. So I guess... If you're really into it, then yeah, it's probably it could be worth it. But personally, I don't want to spend any extra money getting the expansion pack, so I don't have it. <laughs> so I mentioned some game trials, and as you can see here, it's just temporary. So at the moment, it's only until the 26th of Feb where you can trial out some of the games. Moving on to online play, so that's obviously a benefit for getting the Nintendo Switch online membership. It allows you to play online essentially with other people and it shows you some of the games that feature the online play. Uh, here's a list of all of them, as you can see they are 891. Tetris 99 is really really good, I've got that one, I've got Pac-Man 2, both of those are free by the way. Um, so you do get some free additional games with the Nintendo Switch Online uh, membership but you can't access those free games if you don't have the membership so there's definitely some benefits. So as I go through the list here, you can see some are free, some are free and some are paid for. There's a a variety in costs essentially. You can get some pretty cheap games, some expensive ones like that. Pokemon, let's go Pikachu, 50 quid. Super Mario Maker 2, 50 quid. I actually bought that game last year. It's, it's pretty cool. Like you can literally make your own Super Mario World courses and then have you know your family or friends play them which is really really cool and you can play uh, courses that other people have made so that's that it's a really good game I'll definitely recommend it so yeah that's the online play as you can see there's a lot of games where you can play online with other people so that's always good uh, definitely the main the main benefit of having the online membership I would say if there are some game specific services as you can see here um, I don't have any of those apps so I can't talk about those Voice chat is a feature as well with some of these games as you can see. Um, I've played Mario Kart a lot but I've never used the voice chat feature to be honest but it's pretty cool that it's there. Moving on to the NES, Super NES, Game Boy, Nintendo 64 and the Game Boy Advance. Like talk about throwback. I remember having some of these consoles so it takes me right back to my childhood and what's really cool is that you can play the games that you used to. There's a range of different games that you can play and it's just a it'll just give you that nos nostalgic feel um, and as you can see here there's a whole heap of different games that you can play like total classics I don't know if you remember how much of these you remember or how much of these you used to play but I absolutely love the fact that you can play like proper old school games and you don't need the old school console which makes this really really cool and in fact being able to play the classic Super Mario you know back from way back in the 90s um, that was basically my main reason for 
one getting the switch um because i didn't want to have to buy an old console so that was my main reason for getting the switch and obviously the online membership allows me to play classic old mario games not just mario there are other ones but for me mario is like the main the main game and the best games but yeah again you know going across all the platforms you can see there's so many different games you can play and it's all completely well i would say free but you're paying for the online membership it's all part of the online membership so if you don't have it you don't get to play these so it's definitely worth it for that reason and the other benefit of having the online membership is that you can save your game data in the cloud so you've got that backup if you know for if you needed it so backups is always good to have so that's always good nothing more to say on that and then you've got exclusive offers for members so you can see you've got some members only games um, I already mentioned Pac-Man Tetris and the game trials they're all very very useful Pac-Man and Tetris are awesome like they're wicked classic games you've also got members only offers so for example you get you can get two game vouchers for the price of what 85 pounds so basically you pay 85 pounds and it allows you to buy two games which could be really good especially when you have games that are at like 50 pounds if you were to buy two you're saving yourself 15 pounds so that's always good and then there are also some nintendo controllers that you can buy that are exclusive for members only so you've got this nes controller as you can see and this one is 50 pounds you got the snes controller which is 26 pounds 99 it's not bad and it's a nice way to kind of feel like you've got the old school console even though you've got the modern console but pretty cool and then you've got the nintendo 64 controller which again is a lovely throwback and this finally the sega mega drive control pad which you can get for 39.99 so yeah very cool nice little throwback and there's also members only bonus items that you can see here i don't have any of those games so i don't really care for them but it you know if you play any of these games then you get some items so Animal Crossing is quite a popular game I think I've never personally played it but you can get some New Horizons items um, but yeah and then moving on to missions and rewards so the online membership does give you some rewards for playing the games there are missions as well so if you look on the top the three or four is the, the missions that I've completed so I've still got one more to go uh, which is playing the Donkey Kong which I haven't downloaded and in order to complete the mission I would need to basically play that game and I would get 50 points which would add to my platinum points so at the moment I've got 990 and basically the benef benefit of having these points is as they accumulate you can buy stuff from the Nintendo shop which is really cool so you could buy like I'll put on screen what you can get with the points just so you have an idea but yeah so that's pretty cool that you know you can te technically get some products for free by just by playing as you normally would so that's a pretty cool benefit I would say and then the final benefit is the expansion pack which gives you exclusive bonus content essentially but as I mentioned it is an additional cost so it doesn't come as part of the online membership it is an it is an extra essentially um well it's an add-on think of it like that so with that as I said you get some bonus content so for example with mario kart you get the booster pack as part of the expansion pack but that's essentially a few additional courses with other games you might get additional levels it's just basically bonus content in a nutshell uh, in terms of membership options you can see here so i've got the family membership which basically as i mentioned allows for eight different accounts it's 31 pounds 49 for the year you can obviously get the individual membership you can go on a seven day trial so maybe test that out if you if you want um, in terms of the expansion pack as you can see at the bottom for an indiv individual membership is 34.99 but if you have the family pack membership like i do um, the total would be 60 pounds and the 60 pounds is the family membership plus the expansion pack but at the bottom you can see that for me it says 36 pounds 71 that's because the cost is discounted based on my current membership so because i've already paid for just the family membership which was the 31 pounds 49 rather than making me pay the entire 60 pounds just for the expansion pack which obviously wouldn't make sense i would need to pay 36 pounds 71 today if i wanted to get the expansion pack 
and the expiry date wouldn't be a year from today it would be a year from when my current membership ends basically so so obviously in this video if you've got this far you've seen all of the benefits of having the account but what i would recommend is take up the free seven day trial just to test it out for yourself see how you feel after the seven days and obviously if you're happy with it then go ahead and purchase it but i definitely wouldn't go ahead and purchase it instantly definitely take up that free seven day trial and before I end this video, I'm just going to play a couple of the old school classic games just to give you an idea of what they look like on the Switch. So the top four that you see here are all completely free. Tetris 99, Asphalt, Fall Guys and Rocket League. They're all free on Switch Online, which is really cool because they're all really like wicked games. Love them, especially Tetris and Asphalt. Like I'm very surprised that Asphalt is a free game. It's so, so good. But yeah, let's go on to retro games. Let's go way back. Cool, so as you can see here, you've got um, pinball, you've got noughts and, noughts and crosses, or is it the box game, and you've got snake. So obviously we're gonna go with that. Let's go with snake because that is an absolute classic. If you used to play this game, uh, let me know what device you used to have. So my first, I, my first phone was the Nokia 3410, proper classic, I used to love snake. Okay, let's move on to the Super Nintendo Entertainment System. As you can see, a bunch of classics here. You got Spankies, Claymates, Super Mario Kart, proper old. Yeah, there's just a bunch here, you know, Kirby's, Yoshi's Island. Love it, proper old school. I just thought, I'm I just love the fact that you can play these without having to have the old console really cool but obviously I'm gonna go with Mario so let's pick that obviously you can't hear the theme music because I've uh, I've lowered the volume because of copyright as per usual but yeah, as you can see obviously it's a super super old game and it's on a modern console so the aspect ratio isn't what you'd get today but it's you know it's quite nostalgic seeing it like that. I remember having a, a box TV or square TV even. This is a proper throwback. I remember this level. I can probably play this level with my eyes closed. I remember it that much. I was considering buying, trying to find a Nintendo 64 or a Game Boy or something on eBay so that I can play Mario. But when I found out that you can get the Nintendo Switch online membership, I figured, oh well, I need to buy a Nintendo Switch because at least that way I can also get some modern games and play that. So it was, getting the Switch was well worth it. And it's quite mad that I bought it purely to play old Mario games, but throwback. And yeah, look at that star. Yeah. All right, I'll play one more and then move on to the next. Yeah, I proper love this. It's such a classic. Let me know what um, what game you guys were obsessed with. I was basically obsessed with every single Mario game. Mario is basically my favourite. Yeah, I, I just love Mario. And not just this version of the game. There's every single Mario game, essentially. I just love Super Mario Bros. 2, 3, you name it. Absolutely love them. But yeah, drop a comment below and let me know what you guys were obsessed with or still are obsessed with. And would you look at that, another star. I still got it. All right, let's move on. Now let's switch over to the Nintendo Entertainment System, the NES. So we went from SNES to NES. As you can see, the ones at the top are ones that I favorited, but there's a bunch of games at the bottom. You can see Yoshi, Yoshi, uh, Donkey Kong, lots of classics down. I can't even remember remember what other games I used to play as a child. I think so much of my time was taken by Mario, all the Mario games. And I wouldn't just, once I'd finished the game, I would just play them again. I would never get bored of them. All right, cool. Let's go with this one. Just bopping my head to the music, which you guys can't hear, unfortunately. Thanks to copyright. I'm just going to whiz past this one. I'm not going to bother playing on top form this is just a quick demo to show you guys and take you back so my question to you is would you get the nintendo switch for the sake of being able to play these old nostalgic games 
or would you only buy the Switch or have you only bought the Switch for the purpose of playing all the new modern games or both? Let me know, I'd be interested to know. Oh, wow. That was painful me, for me to play that way and painful for me to watch me play that way. <laughs> Terrible. Right, one more. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> now I'm tiny. Little Mario. All right, let's whiz through this. Speed it up. Welcome to Warp Zone. Let's go with four. All right, that's enough demo for now. And that was the Nintendo Switch Online membership. Do let me know what you thought. Drop a comment below with whether it's persuaded you to get it or not. And don't forget to hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe for more content like this. And as always, thank you for watching. Peace.